NVIDIA is an American multinational company that manufactures graphic processors, mobile technologies, and desktop computers. The company diversified into the gaming industry with its handheld games console Shield Portable, Shield Tablet, and Shield Android TV, and now with its cloud gaming service GeForce. In today's video, we are going to do an extensive SWOT analysis of NVIDIA and find out the company's overall performance. Before we begin our analysis, a general reminder to subscribe to the channel. Let's discuss strengths of NVIDIA. Strengths are the factors that contribute to the success of the company. Strengths are those features and key areas where the company is performing better than its competitors. Following are the strengths of NVIDIA. Number one is skilled labor force. NVIDIA has invested huge resources in training and learning programs of the labor force, which in turn results in a skilled workforce, as well as they are highly motivated too. Number two is entering new markets. NVIDIA has focused on expansion and entering new markets. It has been proved successful and helped the company in generating income from the new market stream. Number three is product portfolio. The company has a wide product portfolio that offers large varieties of products, holding more than 2,300 patents worldwide, allows the company to increase their customer base. Also, it has some unique products which are not supplied by its competitor. Number four is strong financial position. NVIDIA has a strong financial position and large accumulated profits that can be used to make further capital investments. Number five is intellectual property rights. The company owns several intellectual property rights that include patents and trademarks. This allows the company exclusive rights over its products and competitors can copy or reverse engineer them. Number six is product quality. Its products have good quality which smoothens the experience of users, which is why it is still valued by the customers and increases brand loyalty. This helps to fulfill customer satisfaction as they find it as a good value for the money they pay and improves their performance in the competitive market. Let's discuss weaknesses of NVIDIA. Weaknesses are the characteristics of the company that places it at a disadvantage relative to others. The weaknesses stop the company from performing at an optimum level and become barriers to achieving goals. Number one is research and development. Even though the company is spending a certain amount on research and development, it is still less than what its competitors spend on it, and therefore, they have a significant advantage of innovative products and more market share. Number two is low current ratio. Current ratio shows the company's ability to meet its short-term obligations, which is lower than the company average ratio. This shows that the company is facing problems in meeting its commitments and can face liquidity problems in future. Number three is high employee turnover ratio. The company has a higher employee turnover ratio as compared to its competitors, which means more employees are leaving and it has to spend more on the training of the new employees. Hence, the company faces increased recruitment costs and reduced organizational productivity. Number four is centralization. The decision-making is highly centralized, which means that decisions are to be approved by top-level management. These were the weaknesses of the company. Now let's talk about external factors of the company. Opportunities of NVIDIA Opportunities are the favorable external factors that give the company a competitive advantage to improve its performance and increase profit. Number one is population. Population is growing at a great pace, and that means there is a chance of an increase in potential customers, so it can target the population and increase its sales. Number two is rise in gaming sector. There is a significant increase in the use of gaming consoles, such as the all-new PS5 and Xbox, which requires high-end gaming chipsets, graphics, and drivers. This becomes an opportunity for NVIDIA to produce the required quality and take the contract for installations. Number three is high disposable income. As there is a rise in customer disposable income and increased purchasing of gadgets, which becomes an opportunity for NVIDIA to introduce high-end products and increase its customer base. Number four is interest rates. Reduction in the interest rates make it easier to fund loans at cheaper rates. The company can take it as an opportunity and undergo expansion projects at lower interest. Number five is technology improvement. Recently, according to the increasing demand for mobile-based technologies, NVIDIA has moved their focus towards the mobile computing market, where it produces vehicle navigation and entertainment software for smartphones. This shows that NVIDIA is improving on efficiency and the introduction of innovative products. It also provides better information on customer needs. 
Now, let's discuss about threats to the company. Threats of NVIDIA Threats are the unfavorable factors that could harm the functioning of the company. Number one is intense competition. Due to stable profitability, there are numerous entrants in the industry. This leads to higher competition in the industry. It becomes difficult for the company to sustain and grow. Number two is customer preferences. As customers' preferences keep on changing, it puts pressure on the company to constantly introduce innovations and develop new products as fast as possible so that customers might not switch to competitors' products. Number three is shortage of skilled labor. Due to the shortage of skilled labor in the technological sector in the market, the company may not be able to recruit the right person with the appropriate skill set. Number four is user experience. As NVIDIA works on improving the performance and user gaming experience with its drivers and chipsets, if some of the user faces any lagging and hanging issues, it directly questions the accountability of NVIDIA. Number five is several controversies. Controversies such as Maxwell Advertising Dispute, GeForce Partner Program, and Hardware Unbox Controversy negatively affected the NVIDIA reputation and the market. We have discussed NVIDIA SWOT analysis in details. This could help you to frame investment decision in NVIDIA stocks for long term. Now the bottom line is, NVIDIA is a world-leading company in computer technology. It has been working for almost three decades and gained a good amount of market share. In the SWOT analysis of NVIDIA, we observe that the company has a good financial position and maintains the quality of its products. But the company has to focus on research and development to improve its technologies. The company can use the latest technology to become efficient. We owe this video on the SWOT analysis of NVIDIA has given you a good insight into the company's strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, and threats. Thank you for taking your time out to watch this. Share your views on it in the comments section below.